but that's a level. But the, the, the thing you learn from this is that there are so many red flags before it gets oh, yeah. to somebody shitting in your bed. Yeah, yeah. You don't. You don't. That start we ignore. Out with that. that we ignore all, all right. the time. It works its way up. There's a lot of red flags between the start of the relationship, between getting somebody's phone number, yeah, and then watching them <laughs> shit in your bed. There's a there's a at least a couple red flags that you well, could point how many, to. How long do you think that goes? How you what what is the distance? Between between the phone number, between the phone number and shit between, in bed. hey, is she single? <laughs> right, right. Hey, she's attractive. To, to going, I'm sorry, did you, you shit on my bed? Hey, how you doing? I'm Johnny. Um, <laughs> hey, I'm Amber. From that, I, I know who you are. <laughs> 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 I know who you are. <laughs> the, to the, the I know who you are to the pulling down your panties and going, oh, I, I got to pull them down further because I don't want to well, get shit on my panties. You know, he's probably got a nice uh, California king, right? Egyptian thread. Egyptian. Egypt, there's easily 10,000 count. 10, the, the count. Easy 1,500 thread count or some uh, Egyptian linen, right? Then you got to. got from. Yeah, these were from the uh, prime minister of <laughs> Egypt himself when I did the uh, promotional tour for Pirates Three. So now you gotta you gotta pull that that uh, that goose down, like you know we're talking about. Now, maybe like a six hundred, like a six hundred mm. thread count goose down with a duvet, right? You got the bed sham. You want to make sure the bed shammy stays down. You got to pull that cover back. Man. It's a lot. That it's comfort a- is heavy because <laughs> it's plush. It's, it's probably it's six, heavy inch, duty. It's it's a heavy six duty. inches thick. This you ain't no Martha Stewart Kmart. No, 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 no. This is no bed, bath, and beyond, my friend. This is, this is <laughs> you got to pull it back, right? Because, hey, I'm not a savage. I don't no, want to no. shit on the comforter, no, right? No, no. That's not no. what this is about. I got to go plus, to the sheet. You got to save something for Christmas time. The next argument, you know, right. where do you go from here? <laughs> and she pulls it back because, you know, I'm going to tell you, when I look at Johnny Depp, Johnny Depp looks kind of like a he's a little soft guy. You know what I mean? He's not a he's not a man's man. I he's mean, I've watched sensitive artist, my friend. I watched Jack Sparrow run. Come on. You know, he. He runs like an old white lady. So, <laughs> in all fairness, that's Jack Sparrow. <laughs> Same thing. He runs. It's like, not. <laughs> I'll tell you this: Jack Sparrow would not allow anyone to shit on his bed. No, he would not. No, he would not. Um, and then, but, <laughs> then she pulls back. So you're talking probably. I'm gonna go with a memory foam, mm. a memory foam top, right? Which is really hard to stabilize yourself. It's hard to stay. She's got to balance herself. She's got to balance. She's got to have massive core she's, strength. She's got to squat down low enough and not low enough. And I heard it was a big, it was a big drop. You know I'm what I mean? Let's see if there's pictures. I don't think I've seen <laughs> pictures because they block them out, <laughs> which is weird that they have to blur out the. That the means shit. she's got to do a half squat. She's got to do a half squat. I've said this a thousand times. It never gets better it doesn't it doesn't, doesn't get better it only doesn't. get worse if that's the way the person's behaving that's what they're going to be if they're going to if they're going to have a nasty attitude that's how they're going to be and it this doesn't change we're it not just, just talking worse. about a, we're not even talking about a nasty we're talking about somebody sh- shitting in my bed well yeah but what like, i'm saying is all right here's the thing though Here, we've talked about this nobody shits in your bed day one no right no, nobody no. nobody that's not the lead off right you, know, is that you, you ignore up. me. <laughs> right? <Yeah. laughs> hey, why did you shit in my bed? You took too long getting back from the kitchen. So <laughs> I felt like I had to do something. It might be, it might be better if it was that way, but yeah. it's not. If it's it, not. It would if be you easy, let off like, with oh. the shit in the bed, you, what happens? Now I got this? some decisions to make. How do I feel about this shit in the bed <laughs> situation? Is Just, this worth it? And here's the thing. This is the other thing. Once a woman loses that kind of respect for you, it's oh, it's just it's a downward spiral. It's just anything is okay. I mean, even I, I bet that when she's hearing her the testimony of all the things that she did to this dude, I think that, that she even thinks, yeah, maybe I went too far. <laughs> mm, see, I <laughs> wonder about that. I wonder about that because she seems to be uh, like a psych, like a pathological liar. Yeah, well. like it's pretty crazy. The level that uh, of delusion that she's having. 
So the weird part about this whole thing is they taped each other knowingly. Mm-hmm. We're taping each other uh, because things were getting heated, right? right? And it was problematic. So some of the things that that end up changing throughout the the whole confines of the relationship, just her perspective on things is insane. It's like just when, I insane. didn't hear that part. What? Well, there's, they taped each other all over throughout the whole thing, but right. her admitting on that on those tapes where he goes, you know, you hit me. She goes, oh, grow up. I I just I. I hit you, but I didn't punch you. There's a difference. And you're mm. such a fucking baby. Mm-hmm. Right. So to hear that, that's one thing. But the the aspect of all like she keeps changing her story. And I think she's a pathological liar who believes her own story at some point. I think that's a real thing because you start to I mean, it goes. So it's either. Yeah, that or but it's let's just, be honest. Pathological liars. They they're changing the story. Because they're aware of what happened, they may believe it after after they right. repeat it. So, but the reason why they're adjusting the story is because they're aware of what it sounds like. They're listening to it, and then the, the perception is, okay, how does this sound out loud? You man, school two o two. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man. Put your happiness first, because if you don't, they won't.